In this tutorial, we are going to learn about the mouse over event in JavaScript. The mouse over event fires at an element when a mouse is moved onto the element. So let me explain you with this simple example. I have the paragraph saying mouse over me to see the change. So here is my page. When I mouse over on this paragraph, nothing is happening because I have not used the event, right? If you want to see the changes to be made on this text when I hover on the mouse, all you need to do is you have to use the mouse over event. So let me create one. So I'm going to create. So let me create the JavaScript with an event name called mouse over. So that way every time when I over the mouse on this particular text, this text would change to something else. So I'm going to create a var. Element is my name of the variable. I'm going to say document dot get element by ID. So here what I'm going to do. I want to change this paragraph, isn't it? So, so when I hover on this text, I want this text to be changed to something else. So let me create the ID for this. So let me call this one as a demo. So come to your JavaScript. I'm going to call that ID. Now all you need to do is you need to call an event. So for that, I'm going to use the add event listener method. So it's going to take two parameters. First one is a event that is mouse over. So there is another event called mouse down. So let me use mouse over. Uh, here I'm going to call the function. So this function is the one who is going to change the actual text. So what I can say, maybe I can say this element dot inner HTML. I want to say hello everyone. Right. So. What does that mean exactly? So every time when I hover the mouse on this particular text, I want this text to be changed to hello everyone. So that's how mouse over event would work. So let me refresh. Let me hover. You have seen the text have changed. So you can use mouse down. There is a different, there is a different mouse event. So you can use mouse up. So when you click, when you mouse up, it would change. So mouse down. There is another one called mouse down so save and refresh when you click mouse down so it's going to change hello everyone so this is how mouse events would work in javascript